Hello everyone, time to grind here, and today we are back with some Peglin. And we're determined because, uh, right, we have, uh, last couple episodes, we've beaten Crucible 17 on the Baladin, and we've also beaten it on the round roll, both of which were very, very easy. And we have been struggling, right, obviously newest Peglin 1.0 a couple updates ago or episodes ago. Uh, we've been struggling on Crucible 17 on default Peglin and on Spinventor. We're gonna try Spinventor today, um, you know, uh, but, uh, hopefully we can get it. Uh, we've had some close runs. And I'm gonna take round guard. You're immune to attack damage while reloading because of how high of a crucible that we're on. That becomes one of the best relics. And I'm determined. I'm we, there's been some throws recently. Uh, I think last episode in particular maybe wasn't a throw, uh, but we ended up dying to upside down man in a very tragic, uh, tragic uh, experience. Uh, elite in Act uh, Three or whatever. Uh, and also. Uh, next episode, we were talking about it a little bit before we were uh, sort of recording, uh, but next episode is going to be a special one because uh, it's actually going to be one where uh, we interview, we're going to be like offline and we're going to be playing Peglin in front or, you know, online screen share uh, with Dylan, one of uh, the, you know, devs that we've talked with a lot in the past. Um, and I got to meet, you know, at uh, the gaming convention, you know, earlier this year uh, and I kind of do an interview. So, um, you know, I've, I've been asking you guys for, uh, you know, um, um, uh, questions and stuff. By the time you guys see this on YouTube, the interview will all be uh, over. So <laughs> don't leave any on this. I mean, leave a comment. I don't know. Saying you're excited. I don't. I'll do whatever you want. I don't know. <laughs> um, but I have been seeing your guys's questions over the last episodes, and I'm definitely excited. So next episode is going to be special for sure. Uh, I'm poor here, uh, so can't really afford anything. Um, I would like to get that chest. I also want money. <sighs> we got one money, I suppose. I suppose. I heard it's time to peggle the meggle. We are, in fact, peggling the meggling. Uh, though we did take nine damage, and that, that you know, really unmeggles the peggle. But it's okay. It's okay. Been a year since I've watched. Well, glad to have you back. Uh, everybody. Uh, we just been, we just been chilling. For those of you guys uh, don't know what's been going on the channel for the last month or years, right? We have been building up the studio in this room and stuff. Um, filmed a lot of really fun stuff. I've made a little bit of progress on the little short film that we filmed in uh, Montana. Go go subscribe to the Neon Apes YouTube channel. Uh, that'll be coming out at some point soon, along with uh, more regular content later this year, finally starting back up now that we've been building this studio back up for it. So, been uh, we've been having fun. Having fun, growing the channel. Stuff like that. Growing the channel for sure. I haven't seen the studio since the Stumped collab a few months ago. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, dude. Love Round Guard. Um, I've actually talked with Stumped recently. There's been a couple uh, collabs I've wanted to do with them uh, that timing just didn't make sense, right? Uh, I could have done some stuff with them, but then I went to Montana. Um, so I eventually want to. They, they were some of my favorite people to record with. They are some really cool individuals. Um, let's see here, though. Let's see here. Um, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and get Rub Orb. We, we like a good rub orb and we're gonna we're gonna upgrade it here and I'm gonna just go for the chest here And we got a little bit of gold. So that's good progress has been made. Oh on the studio. Yeah. Yeah, that's a big. Thanks a hey, extra refresh uh, big. Thank you uh, as always to all of you guys helping support the channel by being a member on YouTube or the Patreons or uh, all of that stuff. I appreciate the crap out of all you guys, you know, uh, helping, helping us get, get closer to doing some even more cooler stuff. Uh, next month, I'm super excited. We're going to be doing a big, our first stream event in a while. Uh, some like super long horror streams some spooky sleepover stream, but we'll talk more about that next month. Uh, definitely get rid of a pebble. Uh, that's really good. And we upgraded that splat orb here. So honestly, Going pretty decent here. Going pretty decent. Makes sense. Adulting equals schedules don't line up. Yeah, exactly. What roguelikes you've been playing? Well, obviously Peglin. Uh, we've been enjoying Peglin. Peglin 1.0 just came out. A lot of fun to be had here. Um, I uh, We've also been playing a lot of uh, Crab Champions. That's probably one of our more popular things right now. I'm just constantly trying out new random indie games, right? Series like um, uh, Crypt Custodian, which we kind of missed last week, but we're going to bring back this Friday. Um, and... Um, yeah, a lot of just random one-off uh, roguelikes. You know, I know we're bringing back Gunfire Reborn eventually to check out the DLC. So it's a lot of a lot of good a lot of good shenanigans for sure. For sure. Let's go ahead and get this bomb here. And then these refreshes might be a little bit hard to get, to be honest. We at least got the bomb. 
bought ourselves a little bit of time. Can't wait for the spoopy shenanigans. Me too. I am very excited. I've started to very much enjoy our horror stuff. And you want to, while you're waiting, right, see some of the horror stuff you might have missed uh, over, you know, any amount of time that you haven't seen. <laughs> We've got that whole spooky games playlist. Um, yeah. I just tried Die in the Dungeon. Is that the one that's still in just the demo? Or is that one officially out yet? I feel like that's the one that's been in a demo for so damn long. Have you seen Mega Loot's game on Steam? I think I did see it. I, uh, I haven't thrown it in my schedule, but I think I saw it. It did look interesting for sure. Uh, Rub Orb. Okay, we'll just max that out. So we have like just something that's going to do a ton of damage. Rubber uh, Kinetic uh, leveling up is an easy win. Hopefully. Get some more crits. Okay, two extra crits. That's a pretty big one. Very interesting. Very, very interesting. Still waiting for your horde tolerance to increase for joy of creation, LMAO. <laughs> I love horror ones. I, I love short ones. Um, I know that's like one of the big, I know more and more people keep, cause that is one of the big AAA horror games, right? I, I know it's really scary. Also more bombs is pretty good. Um, yeah, definitely building up our tolerance for sure. Um, but uh, yeah, more and more like my, my fiance, some of my friends keep trying to get me to play all these like big boy horror games, like resident evils and stuff like that, which I know they're good. I just, I don't play horror games that much to begin with. So I really want to play all these really cool horror, like short indie experiences too, you know? Uh, okay. We're going to let another pebble sink. This is, I mean, this has been a very, very strong, a lot of potential here in this build, a lot of potential here. Joy of Creation was a fan game. That's interesting. Is it using someone else's IP or something? I don't really know much about it. Besides, everyone told me back when I was talking about it a long time ago, I had so many people, my fiance included, like, no, you're not ready. You're not ready to play that game. <laughs> they were like, you will, you will scar yourself. You're not ready to play that game. <laughs> Oh, someone bringing up Dungeon Clawler. That's another game too. I'm waiting for that game to come out in early access. I know there's already other YouTubers that have already made like a billion videos on that game, but that game is still in a demo. It's still in a demo. And um, I don't know, kind of just don't really play a ton of demos or too many early access games unless like, you know, it's something amazing, which right, like Dungeon Clawler, I will play when it comes out in early access. I just, I don't know. I get I get a million emails a day of people asking me to play this demo, that demo, Steam Next Fest, right? Cover all these demos. Ugh. You know, so, but maybe. When it comes out, I for sure will play it. Joy of Creation's a FNAF fan game. Okay, okay. That's interesting. Okay, assemble. This, this assemble attacks everybody. You know what? I'll take that. I'll take that. And you know what? You know what? We got to go big, go big or go home. Go big or go home. I need this to be Minotaur. I need to deal no damage, heal up, get that chest, and then we're going to win the run. Uh, that's not exactly what I was looking for, but, right, we can't really get refresh screwed. We have a lot of bombs here. We got a lot of damage. Um, hopefully, everything will be okay. I think we could do 200 damage here for sure. Come on, 200 damage. If I don't get 200 damage, I'm going to cry live on stream. Come on. Come on. There we go. There we go. It says right on the Steam page, Joy of Creation was inspired by FNAF. Yeah, yeah, that's cool. Interesting that a fan-made game is scarier than a real game. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Okay, these refreshes, a little bit spicy. We did get another bomb. Um, this is going to attack everyone. No way I get the, I was really hoping to get that bomb and the refresh which we probably could do right now. Definitely take it. Oh, I didn't get the bomb. Definitely taking more damage than I thought, which puts this whole thing in jeopardy, uh, to be honest. But you know what? It's fine. It's fine because I'm just going to kill everyone. Right no, I needed that to slide to the right. And it didn't. There's these two good old bombs here. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. And I can't get them still. I can't get them. Come on, bomb, 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 bomb. There we go, there we go. Okay, okay, and we're good. We're good. I mean, we're 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 like almost dead, you know. But ignore all of that. Ignore all of that. Bombs blind enemies. Uh, more non crit for every crit, which would be good for us right now. Um, but I'm gonna. I don't know. In case we do full on crit, I'm gonna take that. Probably still worth it. No, no chest for me. <laughs> Maybe we get a little bit more opportunity to heal though. So. 
I think we're I think we're good. I think we're good here. Um, okay. One bomb. Let's just we need to take no damage. I don't want to take any damage. So we already got rid of the projectile people here. That's pretty good. I'll go ahead and do this to try to get as much money, because I imagine the bombs themselves will probably kill here. So Pretty, pretty, pretty good. Um, probably just gonna heal. I hate to do it. Probably try to, I'll try to get a little bit more money here. Got like four, four or five here. You can't mention FNAF low without Matt Pat. <laughs> Love that he ended up being in the movie too. All right, we'll use this Terra Ball. Not happy about it. Uh, we do, we'll be able to put a lot of, uh, a lot of blind. I think the blind can go on the Leshy. I'm not actually sure. Okay, we are able to blind uh, the Leshy. That's cool. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna go ahead and get the crit here. Hopefully it doesn't hit the- Hey, there we go! There we go! Rub Orb doing tons of damage here for us. Obviously the Leshy's got a lot of health. That was, uh, that was very, very good. Very good. Um, sure. Another crit here. We're honestly doing pretty decent at getting these vines. Oh my gosh! And having two crits and three, or sorry, I think it's three crits and two refreshes right now on the board. Uh, plus having round guard uh, is, is very nice. Very nice indeed. Got some good damage here. I think we're gonna be able to make it to castle here. Sans is, uh, <laughs> is Ness. <laughs> is canon to FNAF. I know, I know he got so much shit for that. I remember watching that video and enjoying it. To be fair, I was a literal child, but you know. Um, okay. Continue getting these bombs here. Honestly, I'm I'm really low. I'm really low. And he does not have that much of a... Uh... Oh, jeez. Oh, that was awful. Yeah, he doesn't have much blind. This is pretty... This is pretty scary here, actually. This is pretty scary. Oh, no. No, it almost hit the crit. Uh-oh. I don't know. I really don't know. Maybe if this hits a crit and hits all- What? I don't even- Did it hit a vine? I didn't even see that. Nope. No, this ain't happening. This ain't happening. Here, you know what? There we go. There we go. Oh, but all oh, this does no damage. But it did get bombs, but it does no damage. But we do have round guard. I don't know. Oh, he didn't- There we go. Okay, okay. It's all gonna be okay. Don't even worry about it. It's all gonna be okay. It's all totally gonna- No, it's not okay. <laughs> okay, that's fine. That's fine. We definitely took more damage on that elite than I wanted to. But we got this here. Um, I have turtle, unicorn horn, screw damage reduction slime. Okay, unicorn horn. Let's do unicorn horn. I believe. TTG, I'm curious, did you know anything about Joy of Creation except that it was really, really scary before this stream? No, no. I mean, obviously, I thought it was some bigger AAA thing, the way people talked about it. It was mainly only because, uh, yeah, it was mainly because everybody in my life was like, no, you're not ready. You're not ready to play Joy of Creation. You will fucking scar yourself. <laughs> that's, that's really all I knew. I only started gaming at all because of TTG. Hey, helping make people more nerds. Let's go. Yeah, I just really don't want to take uh, damage right now here, like early on. Something I always fucking do, and it's so hard to deal with. Honest, I'm glad I got that bomb. It's so hard to deal with sometimes, like early on, taking all this damage that you can't do much about. Uh, and honestly, I'm gonna take a little bit maybe because of them being able to attack multiple times here. It is what it is. We took two, mm, two, four, six. Come on, I just don't want to take so much damage. <laughs> Why? There we go. We should be good. We're 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 good. Pumpkin, it's not October yet. Two chests, that's pretty damn uh, entertaining. Um, you know what, I'll take a small Torb. I'll take a small Torb. Maybe we just need to, we need to get strong here for Crucible 17. Maybe that's what's going on here, I don't know. 
Uh, okay, bombs deal 10 damage. I would love for you to give me another bomb relic here. If that's if that's what we're wanting to do here, I would like it. Apple a day? Okay. I mean, it's not a bomb relic. Um, I will gladly take it here, though. So we're back to the 100 max HP. It's never too early to have some pumpkin. <laughs> One of the things we did over the weekend was um, uh, me and Caitlin and Dan and um, Dan's girlfriend, uh, Daisy, uh, we all went to, to Target over the weekend. Got some fun fall stuff, some some ghost pillows, one or two maybe small stream decorations for when it actually gets October. There's a lot of pumpkin spice themed things as well. Pumpkin spice, chocolate pretzels. Pretty good. Pretty good. Uh, I'm trying to get as much money here as I can because it should be very easy to get these bombs here. Um, let's see. If some of this hits a bomb, so be it. Oh, that was perfect. Now I'm going to definitely deal with the bombs here, though, because... And having Unicorn Horn is so nice for that. Oh, man, dude. Unicorn Horn is so nice. And I got a little bit more money, and everyone's dead. Beautiful. Uh, Pumpkin shows up yet again. Um, honestly, I'm just going to upgrade what we have. Screw the shop here. Um, yeah. Let's do this here. See you later. Have an awesome stream. Yeah, see you too, my man. Can't wait to set up a Halloween tree. <laughs> That's a pretty good idea. Like a Christmas tree, but for Halloween. Yeah, I'm also going to probably uh, see what it's like, right? We have all the blue lights in the background whenever we play horror games. Probably making all the lights red. You know, something spooky like that. We need a Halloween store in January and only January. I don't... <laughs> Uh, I think that should be your business idea. You should, uh, I think, I think you should believe in the idea and you should put all your life savings. Also, wait, isn't that a Rick and Morty bit? I just, I just realized that's like a Rick and Morty bit, isn't it? Something like that. I haven't watched Rick and Morty in so long. I don't know why. Kind of just got like tired of the dan all the nihilism, the whole, I don't know. I've seen some of the newer season and it seems like they've gotten better, but it just felt like it was like, Two or three seasons of just like, yeah, life fucking sucks, existentialism, like, nothing fucking matters, and that's like, the whole thing for, uh, you know. That's why I think Smiling Friends, to me, took, took the spirit of Rick and Morty in terms of what I care about, in terms of shows, right? Because Smiling Friends, you have, you have Pim and Charlie, and you have... You kind of have, I don't know. Because in like, older Rick and Morty, it felt like, okay, whatever, Morty was just like... Whatever, he's a dumbass. He'll he'll follow. He'll he'll be jaded just like Rick, right? Because Rick's a smarter one. But um, yeah, fucking, I don't know. Smiling Friends is good. It's Todd's idea from BoJack Horseman. Oh, I still need to finish that. I was like one season away from finishing that. It's BoJack Horseman's really good. That's a really hard, sad show to get through sometimes, though. <laughs> But in a very different way, very different way than Rick and Morty, just like, life sucks, fucking don't, don't I don't know. I don't know, Rick and, I got very jaded from Rick and Morty at a certain point. Uh, grabby hand, okay, I don't have any AoE. I probably want some AoE at some point in time. Definitely gonna tackle this elite here. We've been getting a lot of chests. We have a lot of relics here. I believe. I believe it. We could actually get these bombs going here. Got one of them. It's pretty good. Pretty good. Red or purple or green for spooky games. I, yeah, I mean, maybe maybe for if it was like a specific forester thing. Though to me, green still feels like it gives off like uh, Christmas vibes. Purple maybe too. It depends on the shade of purple. I would say purple probably. Honestly, I don't know if anything would give me a similar vibe as as much as red. Okay, let's try to get this refresh here. Nope. <laughs> what a great Swoltorb. What a great Swoltorb. Okay, 338 damage. That's 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 doable, right? That's doable. Here, I'll even discard. That's totally doable. Totally doable. Just kind of hoping we'd get a refresh there. See, I don't know. I feel like we could just take a billion damage here. Um, let me try to go get that refresh. Ah, and then it's going to be yet an, oh, uh, there we go. Dude, unicorn horn going pretty hard. 
Unicorn horn going pretty hard. Okay, there we go, there we go, there we go, cool. Okay, okay, we're not too hurt. We're not too hurt, and potion ball. Okay, and I'll upgrade that. That can be some good healing, and refresh also triggers a crit. Okay, we might have some stuff going on. Get some money here, hopefully don't go on the fire. Okay, I mean, we did go on the fire, but it was maybe, it was maybe worth the capital that we gained here. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Okay, rallying heart. How's it rolling? First time in the stream as well. Welcome, welcome all y'all. We're trying to do the hard Crucible 17 shenanigans here on Spinventor. This is our second attempt here. Second attempt. Also, holy shit, <laughs> Indron, thank you so much for the 20 gifted memberships. <laughs> Appreciate that. As always, just talking about all the awesome support y'all have been doing to help me get this studio working. People like Indron definitely, definitely uh, support means a lot. How you doing today? Doing good, doing good. Had a very refreshing weekend. Um, hung out with some friends. I made, um, what's it called? Chicken and waffles pot pie from the Good Mythical Kitchen um, uh, cookbook. Uh, I think I made a video on it a while ago. Um, that was uh, that was the first time I made it. So this was the second time I made it, and it was very good, very tasty, very tasty. Um, love spending like you know the weekend or or time uh, with. Uh, did grubby gloves? Wait, flying enemies are attacked horizontally and take 1.5 damage from projectile attacks. I was wondering what was popping up. So they buffed grabby hands in the newest update. Okay, okay. I like that. It makes it, even if you're just doing a refresh build, it's still pretty good. That's pretty sick. Okay. Okay. I like that. I like that. It'd take a shit ton of damage, though, uh, because of the high crucible. And we're going to take a little bit more here. That's okay. That's uh, okay. Love that. Oh, don't love that, though. Oh, man. See, now we're going to just take a billion damage. Oh, my God. Oh, okay, the extra damage. <laughs> I was gonna say, like, geez, do I feel like I gotta heal now? I don't know. Uh, I made it out of Canada, and then next load, I'm heading straight back up. <laughs> so you're just going all over the place. I mean, I know you normally do. That's sick. Thanks for the third month in a row, Indron. Love getting that random membership notification. I know, Indron and all the other people, Baltazar, everybody, everybody's uh, some badass motherfuckers, that's for sure. Cause yeah, it's been a weird, weird, weird little period of my life right now. Like weird transition period, you know, where I'm finally like, you know, able to like deny some of these contracting gigs that don't pay enough. So I have more time for y'all, but it's not like at a hundred percent, you know, full time thing yet. So it's definitely interesting, but, um, yeah, appreciate the crap out of all that shit. Um, okay. Uh, get rid of a pebble here. A little bit worried about the amount of health that I have. I do not think we should fight this elite. That's for sure. So many memberships. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Remember when that Splatorb is good damage when upgraded? It definitely is. It definitely, definitely is. Obviously, I'm prioritizing these other things, but for sure. For sure. Just a reminder to hit that like and subscribe. True. For those of you guys watching the live stream and the YouTube video, go go like that. I agree with Indron. I agree with Indron. Uh, we'll go ahead and take Lightning here. Level 2 Lightning. And I am not going to fight the Elite because I think we have a chance if we go further here. <laughs> Oh, duplicating isn't good here. Actually, you know what? Potion Ball already does no damage. So duplicating a level three Potion Ball is actually the perfect thing to do here. We'll see if it pays off. We shall see if it pays off. Already like hell yeah. And of course hit that little bail. Southern accent intensifies. <laughs> hit that bail. So hopefully we get a bunch of slime, maybe some of the shitty ass damage reduction slime <laughs> that I make fun of all the time. The fact that refreshes give us crits, very nice. Very, very, very nice here. Here's gonna be our next prime slime. Hopefully even more heals, a little bit more, a little bit more. We see there's like three right here. Um, hmm, boards a little bit. It did, it did eat up a lot of the board, but Okay, okay, get a refresh and then I'm gonna get a good upgrade here. I am very low though. It's kind of the problem. I'm very low, but we did upgrade a little bit. I don't know, I think I'm dead. I don't have round guard. I think I'm actually pretty fucking dead now that I, now that I 
now that I really fully think about it, you know, and I think about my actions and, my, and the consequences of said actions, you know, and I, I ponder what's going on. I think I'm fucking dead. But you know what? We gotta be a dreamer. We gotta be a dreamer. How did I not heal like off of any of that? I'm actually a little bit surprised. I'm actually a little bit surprised. And I think it does eight damage, right? Nope. <laughs> That's the second. Freaking dead. Freaking dead. Uh, but that's fine, because third time's the charm, right? And every time I say that, it always works out, right? Uh, totally, totally. Um, okay, heal one. Uh, yeah, cookie. Let's do a refresh build. What lightning ball does not trigger when hitting slime pegs? What do you mean slime isn't conductive? It's water, for God's sake. I don't think I've ever noticed that. What, does it just not go through those? I mean, I'm imagining it doesn't like end it completely, right? Uh, let's definitely get a, oh, kind of wanted a bomb here. Kind of wanted a bomb. That's okay though. Water is surprisingly non-conductive. It's all this shit in the water. It's like all the electrolytes or whatever and well, like salt and certain other drinks maybe. I guess water itself I don't think has electrolytes. Looks like we're doing some uh, degenerate gambling over on Twitch as well. Oh man, I would have loved Bob Orb, but you know what? I'm poor, so we don't always get what we want. Um, but I'm gonna go fight an elite. If I nope, never mind. My pursuit of money changed my life. <sighs> I'm also not this short. I'm just I I'm now on a higher higher thing. Um, damn man. Well, if we're gonna go for refreshes, I probably should take something like a Swoltorb. And you do, do do get a pretty good discount in the shops now, so I'll go ahead and get that here. I'll go ahead and get that, I suppose. Okay, start off with the upgrade, beautiful. Only a little bit here though. Distilled water isn't conductive because all the salts have been filtered out. I think I need a bandana. I can't eat my noodles anymore since my hair is so nice. Hey! Speaking of which, you can get this bandana or all other kinds of our Monstera Leaf bandanas on our merch site. <laughs> There we go. Beautiful shell. That was a perfect opportunity. Thank you. Thank you for uh, for giving me the best opportunity. TTG, I'll spend 60 bits if you win. Dude, I'm gonna buy a yacht with that. I'm gonna buy a yacht. I gotta do it now. I'm gonna do it. Most water has some electrolytes. I think we should just all lick batteries. I think that's what we should do. A membership ended today. Someone just gifted me another month. Yeah, Indron, Indron, a badass motherfucker, that's for sure. Um. Which, yeah, if you're someone that has been getting gifted stuff and you haven't seen our all the cool, like, exclusive stuff, like the the VODs or the vlogs. Fun, fun shenanigans for sure. Okay, got a little bit of money here. Oh, I'm gonna get a little bit more money here. Maybe, maybe a lot more money than I wanted because, well, no, I'll do this. Come on, give me the eight. There we go. There we go. You've got to be kidding me, TTG. Hey. Also, we'll definitely take another wheel. Uh, we want refreshes. Other wheel is a great consistent damage and consistent refresh here. Red slime and green slime, different distillations. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised this game ends up like creating like a new, uh, or like a mod or something, like a new, um, you know, elemental effect or whatever. And it ends up being like how, how distilled enemies are, like how many uh, conductible, you know, with like a new electricity thing or something like that. Um, okay. I think we'll get some bombs here. Come on. Ah, what about that? Okay. Let's just, we'll hit these. We'll hit these and it'll do something, okay? Everything's gonna blow up and everybody will die. It'll all be beautiful. As long as I do an additional, like, 10, I think? Yeah. There we go. Cool. Is at least to that guy. I need one more bomb. Do I have a good shot here? No, but, I oh, that was bad. Oh, but I could line it up. I'm surprised that hit that other thing. 
Come on, hit. No, we were so close. Ah, we're gonna take a little bit of damage here. Fuck. And then that guy's gonna heal up a shit ton. Ooh, hate that sound. Hate that sound. I don't even believe I could hit this bomb without hitting that one first. Oh! I meant to do that. Totally meant to do that. Totally meant to do that here. Uh, refresh circle. There we go. Definitely taking that. Definitely, definitely. I'll try to go to the right here. Grab some of this money. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, okay. Heal 15. And uh, there was a chance we would have had to fight an elite. We did not have to. Three chests in a row we could get here. Let's see. Every four times the board's refreshed, get some stats. Okay. Okay. That's definitely when we're going for a refresh build. Pretty damn good. Uh, when gaining max health, increase the amount gained by one. Not not useful for us quite yet, but maybe one day. Maybe if I get my, uh, my item. Heal six when reloading. I mean, you know, it helps out. And we'll try to maybe get something. Didn't work out. That's okay. Going to British Columbia all the way on the West Coast this time. Been to all 50 US states, three and three out of five provenances in Canada now. That's so cool. Do you have like an app or like a map or something in your in your truck to track where you've been? That's super cool. I think I've maybe been to like, in my life, maybe like nine states, 10 states maybe. If we got Monstera Leaf, it would be awesome. Yeah, Monstera Leaf would be pretty damn cracked for us. If we could find it. Love refresh circle here, especially. I'm glad that we got the Swole Torb, right? Some sort of upgrade shenanigans are always going to be welcome here. And then we get a little bit more time to get a little bit more money. Would love to walk out of here with 50. Did not happen. That's okay. Um, I will go ahead and get an Assemble ball here, right? Hitting everybody. Uh, let's try to get money, 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 money. Oh, that was not really the money that I wanted. Just a mental ch I guess you've gone so many places, it's probably more like, where have you not been? <laughs> Didn't really want that bomb. Did definitely not want to get both bombs. But I think we'll probably be okay. I think we'll be okay. Allegedly. Allegedly, allegedly. But hey, we got we got some good damage things here. Other wheel, giving us a refresh here. Getting some upgrades now on the board. Getting swole. We need some money to level these things up. Um, oh, I was really hoping that would bounce more to the right. Didn't matter. We're still good. Okay, okay. I can totally do 75 damage, right, guys? I'm not going to take a billion damage. Come on, give me like that refresh and the crit. Tried to get that refresh. I think we're gonna have to. Oh man, here it is, here it is. It's always the last damn enemy. It is always the last enemy, but we did, hey, there we go. Okay, we did heal a little bit, right, on the reload. It's giving me more time to get money. Okay, maybe we actually have decent sustain, I don't know. Um. Okay, well, we'll upgrade. Uh, who are we fighting, Mole? Um. You know what, I will upgrade Swoltorb. I think that's, Probably a big priority, probably. Just started playing Bounty of One. I like it for the type of game that it is. Is that the, oh yeah, that's the Bullet Heaven, like Western game. I think we did one video on that way long ago, like a collab with Sift or something like that. It's really cool. I know, I think it's officially out now or something, right? Seems really cool. Um. Okay. I think we finally have enough sustain. We might we might actually have something going on. Yeah, ever since I started talking about licking batteries, my chat is now talking about how uh, they too lick batteries, or at least did as kids. Don't uh, <laughs> don't don't put batteries in your mouth, y'all. If you do, then and you swallow them like a lot of dumbass babies, like y'all are talking about, then it like rips the inside of your insides. I don't know. As you like walk past things that are magnetic. It's a very fun time. It's a very fun activity, you know? Uh, if you're into like, you know, the insides of you getting like ripped apart and stuff. It's pretty, pretty, pretty fun time. Um, Man, I honestly think I fight the elite. I really think I actually do. I'm gonna go ahead and upgrade Swoltorb. Could take Rub Orb here. 
But I think I already got good consistent damage. Best foot four borb. I'm not gonna take anything though. I'm gonna just I'm gonna just go. Get a little bit more money, probably. Oh, okay. Well, we're not fighting elite. Never mind. <laughs> Screw the elite. It's not happening. I used to only know you and Sift as items and Brotato. <laughs> um, yeah, we have a whole playlist of all the items that we've gotten that rainbow leaf into. Um, I kind of just want refresh perspective or enhanced gunpowder. Very happy with either of those. Enhanced gunpowder it is. Gladly take that. The, re uh, the refresh goggles, I think I would have liked more, obviously, for what our build is, but um, enhanced gunpowder is so damn good as well. Would you take one million now today or one cent doubled every day for 30 days? And then someone did the math. Uh, one cent doubled would yield only 600k. Is it not a lot more than that? I thought it was more than that. I remember doing all those like things. I was like, I remember doing that in like elementary school. Gunpowder's free relics. Yeah, yeah, definitely might help us get some more of the free relics like you're talking about from future chess things. Absolutely. It's way more. The actual yield is over $5 million. Yeah, I was going to say the, um, the power of doubling is pretty damn OP. Pretty damn OP. That's for sure. Nice, we got the refresh. Yeah, I think we're gonna make it to castle. Like I said, guys, third time's the charm, right? <laughs> Why didn't you all believe me? Nice, there's a the little heal. Gunplotter plus uh, the candle's currently free relics. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. One free per area. Or short fuse, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, get some good refresh here. Nice. Okay, we got it. We're making our way into castle. Let's go. Let's go. Memorb, Splatorb. No, I think we just upgrade things. Let's start upgrading Etherwheel one time. Honestly, I'll upgrade Refresh Circle one time. We have two level. Okay. <laughs> okay. And I do remember one of our last episodes might have got thrown by us accidentally taking Endless Devouring. <laughs> Instead of glorious suffering, which I do think we take glorious suffering because we have so much refreshes here. So we're actually getting to do, wait. Yeah, I, 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 cause that's, that's what we actually took last time. We're taking the correct ring here now. <laughs> Unlike a couple episodes ago. If you took a single penny, doubled it every day by day 30, you'd have $5,368,709 and 12 cents. Yeah, pretty, pretty damn good. Pretty, pretty damn good for sure. My assemble does no damage. All right, pretty much everything that we're doing is going to be about upgrading the board, but we do have a ton of refreshes here, which is why I believe uh, this is the way to go here. Do not take endless devouring. <laughs> I won't make the same mistake. Not, the, not this time at least. I'm sure I'll make the same mistake in like a year or something. Um, okay. Don't think we need a refresh here. Still good for that. No, crits don't matter here. I'm just like trying to do a crit. Don't think that would matter. Ooh, still a little bit scared here though. Still a little bit scared. If we could get some sort of multi-ball thing, that would be really good. I don't know if we're going to. There's a refresh and here's yet another upgrade thing here. Hopefully we can get some bombs or something as well. Ooh, jeez. Okay, okay, refresh circle is gonna go pretty hard. This is where a lot of our healing is, and it'll be probably where a lot of our damage is, depending on when it comes in the timeline here. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. The problem is, is endless devouring sometimes is so slow. And I don't know, we might die before, I don't know. I don't know. We're gonna have to pay for healing pretty much every time. I don't know what's going on. We're gonna need some help here for sure. Damn, dude, it's just, ugh. See, now we have an AOE and now we actually have the board upgraded so it'll probably kill everyone and, you know, save our ass. Oh, it didn't even, it didn't even save my ass. It didn't even save my ass. What's up with that? What's up with that?
Okay, there's a heal. Probably going to go not for the elite, but for the chest. So let me go ahead and upgrade refresh circle. Right? So we get more refreshes. So we get more heals. You might need the relic that reflects damage back to enemies. Yeah, I'm pretty scared. Pretty scared. That was a good refresh there. Now we have a refresh circle here. There we go, there we go, there we go. See, especially, I think it just is gonna depend on the board, it's gonna depend on the enemies. Definitely probably want more AoE than I have. Right, if I could get some multi-ball or something, honestly something like horror ball ends up not being terrible. Because it's gonna end up hitting way more things than normal. And, right, it could do damage based on the upgrading things. So no projectile. I think it's going to just be scary when there's people with projectiles. Here, no projectiles. Excuse me. We're going to be fine. Right? And might even be able to catch back up, right? With some of the heals that we get. I don't know. <sighs> I get to go twice here, though. We do heal six. So mitigates almost one damage here. At least Tora Ball is not terrible anymore. Yes, barely killed that guy. Come on, give me the refresh. There we go, there we go. And then we're gonna get one refresh, I believe. I don't know, we healed a little bit. Welcome, welcome, Baltazar. Everybody else here popping in. We're trying to do a refresh build here. A little bit scary, uh, to be completely honest. In fact, I'll heal one more time. I know there's a shop coming up because we definitely are going to go to it. Um, but I, I need to make sure we don't die. That's that's really important here. Ooh, okay, we got rid of a pebble. That's really good. And I am going to... So we're going to have not any money to buy something, but let's see. It's going to be worth the relic. Whenever the board's refresh, dam deal damage to all enemies. Really sick. Ah, I was hoping we could get a free chest there. Did not work out there. Can't afford anything. How do upgrade pegs work? Do they add the number they are upgraded to to the damage or do they count as multiple pegs? Uh, I'm pretty sure they like add their damage to it, you know, when it hits. Also, don't actually want to duplicate all our orbs. Duplicate a random orb. Refresh circle. So it sucks because it's going to do less damage, but honestly, for the build that we're doing, I think that's really good. Uh, we're going to go ahead and remove, honestly, Terra Ball here, even though it's unique. And I do actually want to go to the right. I think that we could kill an elite and I think we need to kill an elite to prove ourselves here. Otherwise, I think Act 3 is going to be really hard. And I think this is good for us here. And also, right, we have we have more refresh circles here. So I'm going to try to upgrade the right side of the board if I can if I can choose a side here. All right, now the upgrade thing here. Upgrade more and more of this right side of the map. All right, refresh it here. So it's always going to be super scary. And then it's going to go just amazing. And Enhanced Gunpowder is going to help a lot. Oh, if only we had more bombs or more ways to generate that or whatever, you know, but... See, I mean, we did that and that was so much. Because also that means it upgrades all those pegs. Definitely need a refresh here. Um, That's what this is for. Damn, 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 damn. Kind of wish I had shot it to the left. I thought it would have done that first refresh earlier. Uh, we do have Horror Ball. Horror Ball is not horrible for us anymore, luckily. Problem is, is he's going to go multiple times here. Jeez, jeez, jeez. Come on, give me this refresh. I really... Yes! Okay. Oh, this is rough, dude. We might lose Horror Ball here. Come on. Come on, we're getting so close. Definitely need the refresh over here. Another ref. Okay, okay, okay. Couple refreshes there. I I think we're maybe. Is that enough or are we dead? Oh my god. I think we're gonna be okay. Think we're gonna be okay here. Think we're gonna be okay. And to celebrate on top of it all, thank you, Baltazar, for the ten gifted memberships as well. Appreciate the crap out of you guys. Now win. <laughs> I will try. I will try. We're very, very low, but okay. We'll we'll upgrade the assemble. We'll heal a little bit. <gasps> oboe, oboe, oboe definitely helps us stay alive a little bit more. Definitely not going to where there's going to be an elite here. God, I got a lot riding on this here. TTG, your yacht is on the line. <laughs> Damage to all enemies when reloading. Okay, 
Wait, what boss are we fighting here? Ballista? Holy shit. We need to have a healthy pool. Whenever you heal, deal some more to damage. Oh no. Come on. No, we didn't get it. I need to heal. I need this to be a normal combat. Okay. That is what I got. I don't know. We still could lose though. We still could lose. Here's some heals though. Thanks to Refresh Circle. And we're going to kill that first mirror at least. Just imagine if the elite was the mirror knight. Yeah, that would be scary. So we're at least going to kill this first mirror just fine here. Okay. And then if this can do three, 400, this will be very good here. Yeah. Yes. Yes. We might be able to recover. I'm definitely going to have to keep healing. I just have to heal. There's nothing. Oh, but I want the assembles. Oh man, I could have, that's two of the assembles, but I need to heal. I need to heal. The upgrades, all this shit, I want it so bad. I need to heal. I know that in my heart of hearts. It's gotta be a heal. Fuck! See, that's why. Cause I'm gonna go in the fire. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> okay. Still, the Splatorb is still level one here for us. And we are going to be fighting some projectiles here, unfortunately. Which is going to be very, very scary. Some of our refresh stuff isn't until the end. Ooh, I don't like this one. I don't like this one. Not one bit. Not one bit. <sighs> so, there's some refreshes. There we go, bomb. Okay, okay. That was not terrible. Not terrible. We do now get a AoE. Okay, okay. Wish, I hope this kills most people, but not everyone. But I think, yeah, we're just gonna kill everyone. Which is gonna suck, because I would have loved more time to do more refreshes here. Damn. <sighs> okay, 46. I don't know how this is gonna go here. I really don't. I really don't. I don't know if we have enough health. We have consistent healing. This is gonna really, this is gonna test it here. That was not a great way for Refresh Circle to operate. Okay, we, we need to heal. We're at 19 health, we need to heal. Stop going to the damn sides! That's not how we get a lot of points. Oh, you motherfucker. Oh my god, stop going to the goddamn side. Stop going to the goddamn side. <laughs> now see, if this was wall, we would have been totally fine. I don't know if I needed to discard. I feel like I really need to be upgrading here. Nope, shit, okay. Here we go. Okay, I don't know. I don't know. That's not gonna be enough heals. God damn it! No! No! We were two HP away. Oh, it hurts. It hurts. It hurts. Okay, well, obviously, we'll try again here. Damn. Uh, refresh moves after every shot. You know, don't take that. I felt the refresh stuff speaking for us. Oh, that was rough, though. Very, very rough. Very, very rough. Man, just imagine if Cookie hadn't been, uh, if, if Cookie was working at, uh, the way Cookie used to work. Like, imagine if we got two heal every time instead of one heal. I know why it got nerfed. <laughs> but we would have been thriving on pre-nerf Cookie, that's for sure. Rip the yacht. Rip the yacht, indeed. Rip the yacht, indeed. Okay, I'm doing pretty good. Trying to make sure I'm going to actually get 25. Yep, money. There we go. Okay, the assemble. It's time for the assemble here. Right? Maybe we lost because we didn't believe in the power of the assemble here, you know? We haven't we haven't completed a full assemble um, probably in over a year, to be honest. So this is one that just uh, adds rubber slime to all our shenanigans here. Wasn't it three every time you refreshed? I don't, maybe like a long time ago. I know like for the longest time it was two per, and then they 
made it, um, and then they made it one per, like, very recently, but maybe it used to be three or something, I don't know. Um, okay, eight damage, come on, give me another bomb would be nice here. Um, can I get that bomb? I don't know, we'll try. Damn it! I, I can't listen to this. I can't listen to this. I can't listen to myself getting battered a million times. There we go. It was three per. Oh, if it was three per, the TTG seal of approval victory rate would be a lot higher. True. Also, okay, we already got another part of the assemble here. So I don't know. Maybe, maybe the assemble is trying to be the hero of this episode. I don't know. Assembles are really good, that's for sure. And we did get uh, one of the most valuable ones, in my opinion, which is the one that hits all enemies. So, that could be something for sure. For sure, for sure, for sure. Well, good luck, have fun, I gotta go. Yeah, appreciate the support as always, Baltazar. Thanks for coming in here and blessing us in the community. <laughs> also, we are now fighting the exact same combat that I just did. Really just depends on whether you can get the bombs, on how successful you're going to be on these types of ones. Okay, oh jeez, oh jeez. See? Okay, 12 damage. Not a lot to everybody here. We're going to try to dig out these bombs. It's just, this map feels really random. It's like, can you get the bombs or not, you know? And I know there's skill in that, but sometimes it feels very, very random. Or randoming. Terif oh, we unlocked the card for the bat, I suppose. See, but now we're going to be here forever. Not able to do 38 damage here. There we go. <laughs> there we go. And a little bit of money here, too. And a little bit of money. The terrifying sound of slimes nibbling away TTG's life, one hit point at a time. It's the worst sound. It's the worst freaking sound by far. <sighs> Another sub. Did I miss something? I don't see anything. Excellent six month subage. It's always TTG exquisite work. Appreciate it. Collecting the assemble pieces feels like searching for the Exodia. Yeah, it really does. Um. Okay. Well, you know what? Yeah, let's upgrade Splatorb. Splatorb is a, is a very decent thing to be upgrading here as well. Damn. Took a little bit of fire damage. <sighs> okay. That wasn't that great. That wasn't that great. Um. Okay, okay. I want to be careful here because I, I like getting money. Money be nice. Oh, I don't want to take damage though. So we gotta, we gotta, we gotta find a balance here. That's the thing. That's the thing. We gotta find a balance. Is gonna hit everybody? I just, there's always so much money on this that you, I sometimes waste out of. Okay, okay. I think I'm gonna have a little bit more time. Still taking some immediate damage. Damage though, which is not, not great. But hey, maybe it's worth it because the money. We even use Horrible here. Really like to walk away with 50 gold. Don't think that's going to happen here though. I just got an ad for mushroom coffee. Yo, y'all should not participate in any of that shit. I will just say they, I think one of the biggest like mushroom, fake mushroom, like chocolate bar things or whatever is uh, currently being sued or something because they're like, I don't know, killing people and it's all unregulated. If you're gonna do something like that, <laughs> I don't know. Have trip sitters and do like real ass mushrooms. Don't, do not, do not, uh, do not participate. Well, I guess it might not have been like the magic mushroom coffee. I guess it could have been normal mushroom coffee. I might have jumped the gun there, but <laughs> my point still stands. Um, what do I want to do here? I'll buy a laser. I'll, I'll fuck with a laser here. Some balls and laser. I could, I could, I could, I could work. That could work, potentially. Okay.
Now this is the one that's hard sometimes. Um, I think we just go for bombs here. Woo! Let's go. Laser very good on this map here. For sure. Um, I was going to use the big one, but thought it was going to be worth it to do some damage there, but obviously it really wasn't. Um, bomb and... Oh, I thought I was on the sem ball, so that would have hit everybody. Nah. Man, I just still damn feel like we're so low, and that does no damage. Damn, damn, damn. How are we gonna still struggle like it? Now I'm gonna take a million damage! <laughs> oh, we're so low! We're so low! Oh my gosh! They did use to replace coffee beans with mushrooms and more. <laughs> Mushroom coffee is great magic ones, I mean. <laughs> okay, well, we're gonna heal. And we're gonna upgrade, I guess, the laser here. And... You know what? Fuck it. I think, I think we have no relics here. I need to go for something. If we lose here, I'll do one more run. Otherwise, Crucible 17 been freaking hard. Um, okay, you know what? I'm gonna do one normal. Even though it's just a pebble. I don't think it's worth doing it, like, with the laser. It's Cause I can just hit the refresh here, hopefully get something cool. That was so pathetic. That was that was actually like unbelievably pathetic. That was unbelievably pathetic. Come on, give me the refresh. There we go. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Splat orb here. I need a crit. Okay, okay, actually. Let's see here. Okay, okay, okay. I mean no what come on. Oh, come on. 77, 77, 77. Let's go. That's what we needed. That's what we needed. Um, I think at that point, sure. Wait, what boss are we fighting? Oh, dude. Okay. Ekorb for the tree boss and that. And we're going prime slime. Okay. 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 <sighs> Maybe. I refresh the board every reload. We like that. We like that. Oh my god. I thought I was I thought I was gonna get that chest. Uh, whenever a crit's trigger, deal our crit damage to everybody. Sure, sure, sure. Sure, sure, sure. Whatever you want, game here. Okay. Oh. Okay. So we're hoping Prime Slime can get us some decent consistent healing. And, okay, 53 damage to everybody. That with the bomb gets rid of the projectiles. It's very nice. A little bit of damage. I at least think we're not going to take any more damage here. Um, and we got a lot of money there. Um, is there any way to walk out of here with 50? Probably not. We need seven more. Definitely would be sick. That's fine. That's fine. Um, question is, do I upgrade something? I think I upgrade something. I'm not going to fight for that elite. I'm going to upgrade Ekorb here. Not fighting for that elite. I, I'm smarter than that. <sighs> um... Okay, we will say, we'll take the thing, I don't know, I don't know. We're gonna take the thing of whenever we discard something, upgrade it here. I feel like that's actually gonna be better. And I really do not wanna fight this elite. Okay, good, we don't have to fight the elite. I'm hoping for a normal combat. That's what I'm hoping for. <clears throat> never eaten, never eaten bought magic mushrooms. Don't know what they actually put in those. I've just been gathering them when they naturally grow. <laughs> Every fall since I was 16. That's lit. Um, yeah, no, all of the ones that like are in stores, they're not real mushrooms. They're not, they're not the real psilocybin thing. Uh, which is whack, because they like market it like it is, but it's just not at all. Okay, nice. See, Ekorb here. I haven't even touched the bombs yet. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. 
I'm just called Rise. Is that, are we talking about the mushroom thing, or was that an answer a reference to someone else? <laughs> uh, I use certain mushrooms. Oh, oh, we're talking about uh, the place and stuff in World War II. Um. Okay. 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 Let's make sure. Let's make sure I don't end up taking damage here. I really don't want to take damage. We are going to be at fifty, though. We are going to be at fifty. I like that. Nice. Okay, perfect. Ooh! Okay, so we heal, and then even though it sucks short-term, summoning circle, obviously. No reason to go to the shop here. And we're gonna hope, probably just gonna heal at this point in time again. Maybe do the summoning circle, because like as of right now, this summoning circle, like it's cool that we get to use the assemble again, but ultimately not like anything. To go crazy about until it ends up firing more than that. We're gonna go ahead and definitely use this to just get all these bombs. That was pretty pathetic. But I didn't go for this middle one because I knew the middle one would be pretty easy to get there. Oh, one HP. Though, so, there we go. I just don't want to take projectile damage. I don't want it. Okay, now we're hoping for money. Definitely, we should be able to walk out of here with a hunt, uh, with 25, I would imagine to heal a single time. Hopefully, hopefully. Oh my God, are we not? Am I not? Oh. Well, here we go. Here we go. Oh, and you're gonna start me off with an Echo Orb? Oh, naughty, naughty game. Mm-mm, mm-mm. Mm -mm. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. We needed we needed optimal shenanigans right here. And this is this is definitely definitely not what I would call optimized shenanigans. Oh no. Okay. Refresh is moving every time. Sometimes that's good, sometimes it's not good. There we go. Got a bomb at least. Ah. We've added a little bit of freaking slime, healing slime, not much. Trying to get it, I can't hit shit though. Okay. Mm. I can't hit that heal. How goes the peglining? <laughs> pretty rough, pretty hard. We have made it into castle at least. But we are gonna now like die very, very quickly here. Okay, okay. Uh, it's not enough. We're gonna, we're gonna die. Boop! <laughs> so we'll do one more run here this episode. One more episode. Or sorry, not one more episode. One more run. One more run here. Um, whenever the boards refresh, still damage to all enemies. I'm gonna do pebbles, get one, two. That'll help me out uh, early here, hopefully, until we figure out what's going on right now. That's what we're going to go for here. I'm um, going to wait on the bombs till everybody is here and ready to get bombed. Sorry, I had to give a dog a bath. Hope, hope that went well. We're on our last run for today here. Um, we're just waiting on these bombs here. But that's fine, because we're going to beat Crucible 17 right now. It's happening. In fact, dare I say, time to gr time to grind, guarantee seal of approval. This is this is the most confident I've ever been in a run, ever. Right when I look at these suffer the slings, it really speaks to me. You know, and it's like, Odin, oh, you're gonna win, and that's like the, what it you know the motivation sounds you know in my head. So that means we're gonna win. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta trust. I gotta trust, trust the thing. See, right? Because then you find things like restore, you know, and you're like, oh, yeah, I guess I could, I could heal some up and still do some damage because it's, you know, spin venter. Are those 3D movie glasses? Um, well, they're actually from Meow Wolf, but it is a 3D glasses though. They are 3D glasses, I think. They are Chroma Depth 3D. 
only for viewing Chroma Depth 3D images, not for extended wear, performing physical activity, driving or operating machinery. Do not look into the sun with the glasses. Chroma Depth HD lenses. All rights reserved. Well, our pebbles definitely do a lot of uh, stuff. Meow Wolf is sick. Which uh, did you go to? Uh, so I've been to the one in uh, Denver, Colorado. That one's banger. Uh, and I've also been to the one in Texas, as that is where I live. Um, and that one's pretty cool too. Definitely smaller. Um, and I really want to go to the one in Vegas. And I think there's like one more as well somewhere on this godforsaken planet. And I'd like to go to that one too. The one in Santa Fe, that's what it is, yeah. I know the one in Vegas, like, they're all kind of different. The one in Vegas is, like, kind of themed around, like, a grocery store. But really, really cool places to be. Really cool places to be. You know what? And we're going to take ball lightning, because we're Spin Venter, and we go pew lightning, you know? And that's that's going to be how we're going to win, because I do. we are going to win this game. Uh, and going into that fire uh, was part of the part of the plan, you know? Part of the plan. Why wow, you really pulled out your uh, late 2000s infomercial voice. Ooh, okay, okay. Let's go ahead and take Perfect Forger. Anytime we get future orbs, they'll get upgraded in exchange for us to um, take some damage. Probably should just say, don't look at the sun instead of not with these. True. <laughs> mm. Okay, you know what? Let's go ahead and take Brand Ball level two. It's pretty good. Pretty good. Obviously got upgraded and we took some damage. One might say today's pegging goes pretty damn hard. <laughs> you know it. Since when do our pegging Mondays not go hard? Two bombs. Don't have to deal with the projectiles. That's all I want in life. Besides to be a homeowner. <laughs> one day. One day. One day. A homeowner away from the state of Texas. Okay, now I don't really want to use the brand ball. I don't think I need to. Because we're doing okay. Because especially, man, Spin Venter, right? We always talk about that. Things like Ball Lightning go so damn hard. Also, I am actually going to go try this. Investigate or we, we we don't actually... Mm, no, no, I lied to y'all. We need to get restored maxed. So no fun, quirky new shenanigans. We have a job to do. We have a job to do. Being a homeowner is overrated. You pay more taxes and you have to pay for everything that breaks. True, but like at least you own something, right? Like if I, I mean, I don't know. It sucks because there are some things that like need to be fixed, but just don't be fixed because of, I, I definitely don't think I, I live, I don't have slumlord, uh, slumlord, uh, you know, uh, renter people, but uh, you know. Definitely, definitely so many things I hate that, like, I feel like just won't ever get fixed, you know? Say this as a homeowner. I uh, know, I know. Um, okay, definitely don't want two fireballs. If it was one fireball, I would still say no, but I'd be more likely. Uh, definitely not going to take that on duplicates. We do not want duplicates here. Okay, okay. I think this is a pretty doable elite fight here. Hopefully not going to take any damage. Hopefully not going to take damage. Oof. Okay. Okay. Lightning's a little bit far out. Hopefully we can... Oh, get some of these bombs here. Man, a lot of wasted damage on that one. That's okay. I will go ahead and use Bramble even though it hurts me. All three bombs... Or, sorry, two. Ooh! Ooh! Baby! Forgot about the, uh, I thought it needed to be level three for that. Oh, it was level two going to level three. Uh-huh. See, I thought we got a level one that got upgraded to level two, but we got a level two that got then upgraded to a level three, which gave it the overflow. That was sexy. That was very, very good. Very, very, very good. Very, very, very good. And I don't think we need to bramble. I don't want to hurt myself anymore. Ooh, no, no. I still don't think we need to. Splatorb should be able to get it done without hurting me. And I was correct. So we've killed an elite. And we have 50, our favorite number here. 
uh, which allows me to upgrade Restorb and honestly take Concentration, which is now a level two. And then whenever a crit is triggered, deal it to all damage or every shot. I'm gonna take every shot's a crit when fired below. That can save our asses sometimes, um, especially on these high crucibles. So we'll, we'll go that. Probably gonna fight for this elite here again. Yo, max HP up. Okay, then we definitely make sure we can take this elite. That for sure needs to happen. Ooh, potion ball. I definitely just want potion ball. Just give me potion ball. Just give it to me. Just give it to me, baby. Let's go. Okay, and then we're gonna really hope to be able to fight the elite. Nah, okay. We're not able to fight the elite, unfortunately. Um, we are going to upgrade Potion Ball to now already level three. Okay, guys, I told you. I told you. Time to grind guarantee sp uh, b b b approval. That's, that's, you just got to believe. And I'm believing pretty damn hard right now. I'm believing pretty damn hard here. Let's kick this slime's ass. Okay. Our first ever level three restore, but building up our max HP, sitting at 112 max HP. We also have a wonderful start to a potion ball here. Uh, never mind. That was the worst potion ball the world has ever seen. But ignore that. Because we st I was also that was pretty terrible ball lightning as well. But we have a brand ball here. We have a brand ball. And when there's a brand ball, there's a dream, you know? Especially since slimes got nerfed. I think that does a little bit less damage now. And this is totally gonna hit that refresh. Fuck. Oh man. Oh, just give me the goddamn refetch. Just give it to me. <laughs> okay, we're going for it. We're going for it. We're going for it. Yee! Let's go. Let's go. Okay, okay, okay. Problem is, we haven't really done much damage, like at all. Um, I don't know. Take the refresh. <sighs> okay, we're both about half health here. Okay, 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 hit the crit there. 102. It's aight. Oh, and now we're guaranteed crits here. Guaranteed crits. Love it. Love it. Told y'all it would save our ass here. 220. Get a good refresh. Guaranteed crits every time. Is going to get us the W back into castle. Let's freaking go. Woo! What is the later FPS roguelike? Oh, a game called Wild Bastards. I'm very interested. So if you're into our uh, shooter roguelike content, definitely stay tuned for that. Um, so this is also interesting because there's the assemble and another restore. We definitely got to bring assemble into this here. And you know what? Even though the restore, no, no, I got HP. I'd rather focus on the other shit that we got going on here. You know what? Let's do ball lightning, kinetic meteorite. Multi-shot, um, uh, maybe multi-shot, maybe, maybe multi-shot, honestly. Yeah, Matryoshka, minus two, minus two. I think I can handle that. Yeah, that's going to be the fun one. That's going to be the fun one. I was either going to do that or Kinetic Meteorite, but we'll, uh, we'll do that. And we're fighting the Painter here. Oh, that one, it is really good, trust me. I'm excited. I'm very, very excited. A little bit scared of these mirrors here. A little bit scared. Jeez. Dude, mirrors, mirrors haunt me. When I was a kid, right, I saw horror movies, or I saw a horror movie trailer of like, you know, creepy shit you see in the mirror, and that shit scarred me for life. And uh, you know what? Mirrors to this day still haunt my ass. I'll never fucking escape. I'll never escape. God damn, okay. Um, well, I mean, I imagine a terrible, well, no, that will probably won't do any damage here. Every year the mortgage company says they fucked the math and I have to pay more than the last despite owing less money. Yeah, that'd be whack. That'd be whack for sure. That'd be whack for sure. I'd be like, I'm gonna lawyer up. No, I don't know, I don't know what's going on. Uh, okay, this does way more damage crit. Definitely need this refresh here. No, I believe. I believe. There we go. There we go. See, and Matryoshka is going to go pretty hard on uh, Prime Slime. Hopefully. Hey, there we go. Crit. Oh! 49 damage.
damage! Oh, and I might have just killed myself a bramble, actually, because of the... Oh, fuck me. <sighs> Dude. Mirrors suck. So bad. So bad. So bad, dude. Fuck mirrors. I think we should make them illegal. Vote for me as president. I hate mirrors too, but for a different reason. Oh no. <laughs> or I don't have prime slime. I have uh, whatever it's called. Potion ball. Um, okay. 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 Well, we're going to heal. I'm going to upgrade. So let's upgrade concentration here. Uh, and you know what? I'm not going to go for an elite. I'm going to go for the left. I am going to get a heal of one. That one's going to matter here, right? Remember when I died earlier in castle? Um, okay. House of Slime or Refresh Shield, I'd be fine for. I'm going to go for Refresh Shield. And I got it. Refresh the board every reload. Cool, cool, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Um, okay. Rub Orb, maybe? I would take a Rub Orb. Not going to take the Lightning, obviously. Okay, okay, I'll take Rub Orb. Come on, let me go to the chest here. Nice. A double ear infection? That sucks. I hope you feel better. I think I had so many of those as a kid, I had to get like tubes in my ear or something. <clears throat> I don't like mirrors. When I look at them, there's that guy and he's always making faces at me. <laughs> so true. We are still healing and building up our max HP, and we ended up actually getting a lot of bombs here, and the bombs do extra damage. Uh, and we're gonna get to do a prime slime here, which is gonna be pretty cool here. Just hoping one of, there we go, it's like, where are the refreshes at? But there we go, we got some heals. More bombs. Kinda hit these uh, heals a lot. And we have 116 HP, so we got a good health pool. If I have had 17 sets of tubes already. Holy shit. Now that should have been, eh, whatever. I was gonna say, probably should have been targeted at someone else, but. Glad we have Rub Orb too, because uh, Match Your Orbshka Shell with uh, Rub Orb is, is great, great, great. Great, great, great. Okay, um, even though there's a shop, I'm gonna just heal. Yeah, be a little, little bit of a baby here. Fuck! Okay, we'll try it again. Okay, okay, I'm done attempting to heal to then go on the fire. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. Uh, we, we're gonna spank this guy. We're going to rat him out. Fight an elite. No ramifications will happen. There will be no ramifications. Because now we're getting guaranteed crits here. Ah, unfortunately... Shield kind of sucked a little bit there. We have the guaranteed crits. Just really would like a refresh here. At least we're able to now deal with the projectile people. I think I gotta break that. There we go. Okay, well the refresh will be- No, and I can't even kill that guy! Oh jeez. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. We're totally gonna be okay. It's totally gonna be okay. And I should have, I'm targeting the wrong person. Though, you know what? No, that's definitely targeting the wrong person. Fuck me. Fuck me. Is it over, guys? Is it over? Might be over. Might be over. You know what, we're gonna go ahead and target, honestly, target that projectile guy in the back and somehow not even do any damage to him. <laughs> Oh no! Oh no! Okay, Prime Slime, you better be the primest of sli or Potion Ball, whatever your goddamn name is. Okay, okay. I, it doesn't look like there's much uh, healing slime there to me. Just gotta say, you might have some poison up your sleeve. There ain't no, there ain't no healing. Yeah, we're definitely dead by the way, y'all. I got all the healing I could there. I needed that refresh. There's no way. There's no way. There's no way we're dead. No! Oh, man, oh, man. Well, I guess we have 
maybe I shouldn't have fought that elite. I thought 50 was going to be enough. I thought the healing was going to be enough there. And um, I guess it wasn't. That's okay. That's okay. Uh, we uh, we, did, we did still have some really fun uh, refresh and assemble builds, you know. Uh, I definitely had some fun. Uh, and uh, yeah, I, it just seems like, yeah, Spin Vent. I wouldn't expect to be stuck on Spin Venter, you know. Uh, but Paglin and Spin Venter are still our, uh, our points here uh, that we're stuck on Crucible 17, right? Obviously, next time we play is going to be a special episode. We're going to be filming it offline uh, while interviewing Dylan uh, and uh, playing with him, seeing what uh, his, his builds and stuff like that are real fun uh, with and stuff like that that he likes. Uh, so definitely excited for that stay tuned hopefully we'll get over this uh, crucible 17 hump uh and also maybe um you know we will next episode with a uh, good luck charm of dylan or something um also i think real fast we um we did there was something new we got a new card for something here right it was like a um or was it lore here slime drops are born with innate knowledge um Maybe it was that. Slime drops are born with innate knowledge of how to defend themselves with their slime, how to learn how to use a sword. I feel like we already got those, though. Slime drops acquire their sword and absorb the knowledge from how to wield them from devouring stray knights that venture too far into the forest. Ooh. Was it the bats? Despite being the scourge of many creatures, baddies are very effectively preyed upon by aptly named venom bat traps. I think it was already that. Or, okay, it was the bat, yeah, that we unlocked the card for, so... Really, really cool. Cool shenanigans. Always cool to have a little bit of, uh, you know, stuff that we're still grinding or whatever here in the future. Um, but, uh, yeah. So, uh, if you're watching after the fact on YouTube, make sure you guys subscribe. Uh, ring that bell. I go to the big boy YouTubers say to be notified of when more Peglin videos come out. If there are some, they'll be on the screen right next to me. And if you guys are going to be grinding out some of Peglin on your own, then I wish you guys luck. And I'll see you all next time.